I haven't personally been at one of these uh, where I've seen this much excitement since, you know, maybe one or two of the Apple events over the last, you know, in 10 years, I mean, some of their big introductions. The uh, There's an incredible amount of general excitement, interest, and energy here just overall. I think the couple of takeaways that I had is um, we're seeing uh, faster models, cheaper models, more powerful models, all wrapped into one. Um which is, I think, great for our community, uh, but also just generally the community of developers looking to do really interesting and fascinating things with AI technology as a whole. And I, um, you know, I vacillate every time I, I hear something between, gosh, this is incredible, innovative, exciting, between that and then thinking, well, I wonder how many startups this is going to put out of business today. <laughs> you, you know, it's like, 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 like I really... You know, um, so it's it's an interesting dynamic to think about. But, you know, a more powerful, faster, cheaper um, and a bunch of little personalized type of uh, assistance that are also possible as well. That I think is really fascinating. And it's so cool when you get mentioned as part of the keynote uh, address, right? GPT-4 Turbo can now accept images as inputs via the API. It can generate captions, classifications and analysis. For example... Be My Eyes uses this technology to help people who are blind or have low vision with their daily tasks like identifying products in front of them. Absolutely. I knew Be My Eyes was going to be mentioned in there somewhere, and you were. Fantastic. It was uh, kind of crazy, you know, like it's surreal to think about this, you know, this tiny little enterprise that we are in many respects, um, you know, kind of being, being together with, you know, a company that is arguably you know, leading or certainly at the forefront of one of the most interesting technological developments of, of our lifetime. And so um, um, I'm really happy for the, the team, our technical teams and our sales teams and everything to just get that. But um, but also, guys, that, that um, I don't know about you, but I can't remember kind of a, a giant moment in a keynote that was like um, part of the almost the cultural zeitgeist of the day, right? That as prominently featured accessibility as this, right? I just think that's cool, you know? And so I'm, I'm, I'm really happy to be a part of it, but I'm also really happy for our community, the, um, um, being top of mind, you know, it's just, it's just cool.